What's up guys and welcome to Nutero. I am the energy and intuitive reader and I'm here to do the current path spread for somebody. So before I put the charm, I do want to say that this video is going to be about the current path that you're on right now. Okay, we're going to see what path you're on, what you did to get there, the purpose of the path and the result of this path. Then we're going to ask the universe for three advice slash guidance cards at the end. All right. I also do post on Snapchat. That information is in the description box below. And last but not least, we got the Eddies. What's up, everybody? Thank you so much for being here. This message can resonate with you if you have Aries as a sun, moon, rising, or Venus sign. All right, Aries. Or any other placement that you want to watch, you absolutely can. You are free to watch that for this video. All right, Aries, let's see what path you're currently on at this moment. I also made this spread of myself. You're the only zodiac sign that knows this because you know what? You're the last one, so you get all the juicy secrets. <laughs> all right, Aries, I'm going to pull four cards for you. It helped me, so I was like, you know what? Let me put it on my YouTube and see if, oh, okay, and see if um, it'll help someone else out there. You have the Eight of Wands in reverse here as the crowning energy, which is the main energy. We're going to get back to that. So, Aries, what path are you on right now is a justice in reverse. There is a path of you making something right here or something. The path that you're on is an unfair one. Why? I feel like there's, um, it's unfair to you, okay? Because I feel like you're lining yourself here and you're making something a lot more difficult than it has to be because you're not kind of checking in with self. You're not going into inside and being like, hey, am I okay with this? Is, is this all right? Is everything okay in there? It's like you're just going through everything and that's what's unjust right now is the fact that you're kind of hiding or lying to yourself, saying that something is a lot more difficult than, than um, you know, it's like you're making something seem like it's not as difficult than it really is here. Okay. Um, what did you do to get here? You had the Knight of Swords. You rushed into something. Okay. You rushed into something. You had the Knight of Swords. The Knight of Wands in reverse with the Seven of Cups. And because you rushed into something, it was like there was an illusion here that like if you don't go quickly with something here, it's like you're you're not you're gonna fail. Okay. And that and these thoughts were really worrying you here. So um you know, that's kind of why you're at where you're at now. Now something something happened that you feel like is unfair. Um, but it's because you ran towards something with such the quickness and you going towards something, you didn't go towards it because you knew it was the right thing for you to do or, uh, you know, it felt right. It was more like, I'm going to do this because I don't want to fail. And our intentions towards going towards anything should be because it's the best thing for my soul, for my, um, for my well-being, for my spirit, not because you don't want to end up losing or not winning something or not succeeding in a certain energy, okay? Uh, the purpose of this path, Aries, is the nine of pentacles in reverse. <clears throat> so the purpose of this is to, is to not depend on people. Eight of wands, nine of coins in reverse with the seven of coins in reverse. It's like you have the nine of coins here twice. Like they really wanted you to learn that you cannot depend on others. You have to find it from yourself here. And I feel like that's why you were so eager to go towards whatever this is here. Um, it's like you have to have faith in yourself, knowing that you could do it by yourself independently. You don't need another energy to aid you in whatever this is, to help you with whatever this is here. Things will move a lot more quickly if you accept that you have to do this alone. And I know that could be a hard pill to swallow, but realizing it and kind of just accepting it you feel a lot better inside and out okay 
the result from this, Aries, is the Nine of Cups. You getting your wish. You getting what you finally want, okay? Six of Wands in reverse. Three of Swords. Oh, I read two. The Wheel of Fortune and the Four of Swords, both in reverse. Now, this happiness here, okay? I feel like... Mm, Okay, this this is a message, okay? <sighs> the result of this path for you, Aries, if you if you end this situation in pain, you know that it wasn't the path for you. I mean, I can already tell you that it's not, but um if you ended this this path with confusion and things not moving forward, that is the point here. I feel like as well this is kind of like what you were hoping for. You were hoping that things were going to work out good. Things were going to be faded and they were going to be destined and be successful. But it turns out that's not what is going to happen here. Okay? I feel like the result is going to be your emotional fulfillment. But after some pain here. And the success that you want isn't going to come by you... That isn't isn't going to come by you um, getting your wish. It's going to come by you first becoming independent within yourself. And then you're going to get your wish. Like you, I see the three of swords. So it's like you're, you're going to have to get hurt. You're going to have to go through pain and, tr and, and you know, trial and trambulate trial. And I can't say the word. <laughs> All right. So what's crowning you is the eight of wands in reverse with the five of wands with the... Ooh, the nine of wands in reverse okay what's crowning you is like the umbrella it's like the fog the cloud over this energy a lot of delays that's going to cause um a lot of bickering a lot of challenges it's going to make things really tough here but the universe doesn't want you to give up here okay so you stressing out here um you could be really stuck in the past you might not want things to turn out how they did in the past don't even think about the past here a lot still be vulnerable do not put your guard up once things get tough okay because the universe still wants to come in there and allow you know allow them to come into your energy and bring people and resources that you need but if you're closed off you won't get it okay so Aries the advice for you here is thriving things are going to look up a lot more for you here okay you will definitely be will be thriving and moving forward so don't worry about that you have love self-love they want you to pour some energy onto you they want you to choose you at this moment you are the most important person at this time and for this life path you were in an unjust situation because you put yourself there okay i'm gonna be honest with you but you had a certain illusion you had a certain vision that wasn't the right one okay you might have followed your mind versus your intuition okay um and our mind does a great job at impersonating our intuition so it could be very difficult to tell which one is which but this could also be a lesson for that too right knowing you know those signals that your intuition tells you versus your mind and you have power here okay so they want you to take control here you have the power all right you see there's a storm here that is in the far distance and it's like you're looking at this storm wondering what you could do here and you have all the power to move, maneuver, do what you need to do. No one is putting anything up against you. People might make you feel like you're making the wrong choice or doing the wrong thing. But you need to go with what feels right here. Right, Aries? So that I have for you today. I hope this helped. Have a good day or a good night whenever you watch this. And stay positive.